here back today with a video and before I get into the review between the Melbourne Storm and the New Zealand Warriors for the pre-season game which finished not long ago I'd like to thank those who have tuned in to the live reaction this afternoon I really appreciate it thanks to those who tuned in and it was great fun to watch the game again first Warriors game of the season yes it was only a pre-season game but it was just good to have footy back on it was great to see the boys in action for the first time this year but I've got to say what a very interesting game that was you know there was a few errors there was a few momentum swings with Melbourne you know leading twice in this game but what I'm going to do is go through the game give my thoughts and give a man of the match and go through plays that really stood out in this one but let's get into it so it all started off Melbourne Storm they had a few opportunities. They did crack the Warriors in the 35th minute. And it was a try to Xavier Coates. His first try in Melbourne Storm colours. Very soft defence from the Warriors leading into that try. And um, yeah, Melbourne Storm made us pay then. They scored first for Xavier Coates. And then in the 27th minute in the first half, Brandon Smith crosses over. He scores two strong too hard to handle Brandon Smith and he crosses over the score to give the Melbourne Storm an early lead of 10 points to nil. And then the Warriors showed a lot of resilience to hit back here and they scored a try through Marcelo Montoya. And Marcelo Montoya, it was great work by Rocco Berry, Bunty Afoa, some quick hands and um, easy try for Marcelo Montoya in the left hand corner. And the Warriors get back in the game at that point. And then from there on, Marcelo Montoya scores again in the left-hand corner. Quick hands is from Rocco Berry, and he gets a double. Montoya is second try of the game. And um, leading into halftime, Reese Walsh crosses over to score a try. And uh, the Warriors, they go into the break with a lead at halftime. Now, going into the second half, it was great to see some young players come on. The likes of Garrett Smith, the likes of Jaden Corrigan as well, getting opportunity. Reese Walsh um, came off late in the uh, second half there, so he got a bit of a um, reprieve. So it was great to see some of the young players come on and, and play some minutes. And Garrett Smith, he scores a try as well. The likes of Junior Ratu, it was great to see him out on the field with him crossing over the score and towards the end to give the Warriors and Matt Lodge as well, crossing over as well, to, to make sure the Warriors come away with victory. Full-time score, the Warriors winning this one 30 points to 16 over the Melbourne Storm at Casey Fields in Melbourne. Look, players that I thought had a standout game, Bunty Afoa had a great game. He was awesome. He had a great performance. Also, the likes of Eliasa Katoa, who's looking very fit, I've got to say. He's looking very fit, Eliasa Katoa. He's looking a lot bigger. He's looking a lot fitter. And it is great to see Eliasa Katoa have a good game. And also, Bunty Afoa was great, like I said there. And uh, look, the halves for me, look, I'm going to say Ash Taylor and Cody Nkrumah were a little bit quiet in this one. I think they were a little bit quiet. Our outside backs were great. Marcelo Montoya and Rocco Berry formed a great combination there. They were great. They were outstanding. Rocco Berry especially, assisting in a few tries for Marcelo Montoya. So, a solid hit out for us. I'd say it was a very solid hit out for us. 
for me, coming into this game, it wasn't about result. It wasn't about beating the Melbourne Storm. It was about putting a good performance on the field for a full, full game. And that's what I believe we did. We didn't start off very well. We had a pretty poor start, but we fought back very well. And um, it's preseason at the end of the day. So it's only the first preseason game of the season. So as a Warriors fan, and I know a lot of Warriors fans will not be getting too overhyped about this result because we know that it doesn't mean anything. It only means more at the start of the NRL season, during the season when points are on offer. But it's a good hit out for us. It's a very solid hit out. Not many injuries, so that's great news. We didn't get any injuries in this game. I saw Reese Walsh come off with a look. It looked like a bit of an injury, but I'm hoping it's nothing too serious here. But besides that, good solid hit out for the Warriors in this first preseason trial game against the Melbourne Storm. Let me know down in the comment section below. What are your thoughts? Of the Warriors' performance in their first preseason trial game against the Melbourne Storm, we take on the Gold Coast Titans in the second preseason trial game next Saturday afternoon at Redcliffe Stadium, Morning Daily Stadium. So, any Warriors fans who live in Redcliffe, make sure you get on and support the boys and watch our final preseason trial game of the season before March, before the season proper gets underway against the Dragons. But let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below. I appreciate all the support. Thanks to those who have recently have subscribed subscribed to the channel. I really do appreciate that. Click the thumbs up on the video. Click the like button. Click the bell so you don't miss a notification when I do a new video. Or go live next on the channel. And also go check out my social media platforms. They are all on screen or in the link in the description below. But thanks guys for watching. Great to have footy back. And um, bring on next week's game against the Titans.